Hey, it's Genevieve with I Pivot Now. Going a little off topic today as several people have approached me being overwhelmed as they're hosting dinner guests, friends, family for dinner who are gluten-free or living gluten-free. And it's understandable, it can be overwhelming and we certainly don't wanna send anyone home with upset tummies or not feeling good. So I'm here to share with you just some of our simple and quick go-tos for dinner that are absolutely gluten-free. Um, I'm not being compensated by any of these brands whatsoever. I literally just pull them out of our cupboards. So here we go. The easiest thing I think for dinner is serving a fish or chicken. Um, you can barbecue, you wanna put it on the grill. We got Sweet Baby Ray's barbecue sauce, that can be great. If it's during the winter, putting chicken, um, again, there is plenty of processed foods that are gluten-free, right? The Southwest style chicken is, um, it is gluten-free. If you wanna do something in a crock pot, a super quick one is the yum yum sauce. Uh, this is gluten free, right? Just cut it up or I've even just thrown it in the oven. Chicken, yum yum sauce. Go ahead and you can serve it over some rice. Some jasmine rice is lovely. Or if you don't even have that much time, you can do the minute jasmine rice, right? Um, that takes about 90 seconds. Or if you're really short on time, good old Bob Evans original mashed potatoes takes about three minutes in the microwave. Or another option, going to sweet potatoes, baked potatoes, those are all lovely as well. Uh, the one thing I will share is with any pre-made marinade, just to be very careful because soy sauce has gluten. So you wanna avoid any pre-made marinade that has soy sauce. If you make your own, um, if you wanna go a step further, there are alternatives to soy sauce, the liquid aminos. Actually, a lot of people like this, a much less um, sodium and it can be a one-to-one -one ratio or go to the soy sauce area and Kiko Mom sells gluten-free soy sauce that, that you can use. Um, all right, so if you're serving a salad, right? Any fruits, fresh fruits and vegetables, those are all gonna be gluten-free. The salad dressing, Ugh, a lot of salad dressings actually do have gluten. So if you're just trying to be safe and easy and not go crazy, just some good old olive oil and vinegar. If you normally serve bread as a side, that's kind of hard. Our family actually has not found any, you know, bread that we really like on the side. And so what we eat oftentimes is the crusties gluten-free blueberry muffin mix. That's pretty delicious. Uh, something else that's delicious and probably not nutritious is the Red Lobster Cheddar Bay Biscuit Mix gluten-free. Most of these um, boxes are typically found on the top shelf or the very bottom shelf, all right, if you're looking in the grocery store. Um, what else do we have? Oh, if you want to go to the store, right, we have, we love, this is our favorite, um, pasta, Barilla's gluten-free pasta. Go ahead, let's see, do we have some spaghetti sauce here? We do somewhere. It is Muir Glen. I like it because it is very, oh, here it is. Sorry about that, folks. I'm back again. Uh, Muir Glen has very little uh, um, sugar um, and it is gluten-free. You can do, so spaghetti meatballs, these are frozen, cooked perfect Italian style meatballs, all natural. Make sure that you see the gluten-free check mark though because cooked perfect has a variety of choices out there and they are not all gluten-free. So again, the cooked perfect Italian meatballs, looking for the check mark, gluten-free, right? So after dinner, you need a little sweet treat, you need a little dessert, here is the bomb. Trader Joe's gluten-free chocolate chip brownie mix. People love this. People that aren't even gluten-free love this. I've had numerous friends and neighbors that after eating these brownies, um, they actually start making them even though they're not living gluten-free, right? If you're celebrating something, a birthday, a graduation, what have you, Pillsbury gluten-free yellow cake mix. 
Um, actually, I don't know of any frosting. There, there probably are some frostings that have gluten, but um, most cake frostings do not have gluten. Betty Crocker, gluten-free, typically they're all labeled. Um, if you want something to go, this is delicious. Tate's Bake Shop, um, gluten-free chocolate chip cookies. It's sold everywhere, Publix, Lowe's, food stores. Um, Walmart, Trader Joe's, Harris Teeter, you name it. And I think we're out right now, but the ultimate in processed foods is now they make gluten-free Oreos. Those are pretty um, easily labeled as well. So hopefully that can help you out, decrease your stress or overwhelm when you're hosting someone that lives gluten-free. Take charge of your health and well-being over and out.